Second race weekend of the BMW IBSF Women's Skeleton World Cup at Segulda in Latvia for the second week in a row and into the second of our heats. Laura Dees of Great Britain lying seventh after run one, finished sixth in the first weekend's action and a good second heat from the Olympic bronze medalist put her at the top of the pile ahead of teammate Ashley Pitaway. Germany's Jacqueline Lerling and Belgium's Kim Meilmans have both failed to improve on Dee's time as we got to our top four. Tina Hermann of Germany next to go. Despite being slow away at the start, she finally managed to find speed at the bottom of the track and a clean run through the last few corners left her over a quarter of a second clear. But she was not happy. Kimberly Boss of the Netherlands had been the silver medalist a week earlier. She lay in the bronze medal position after heat one, second in the World Cup standings. Could she take another medal? Well, she had an advantage over Herman, but it was a slender one and at the line. None of it remained. They were tied for the lead with two to go. Both would be in the medals. Elena Nikitina of Russia had struggled a week earlier on what is Russia's second home test track. But today she was firing on all cylinders. A great second heat to put a clear of Herman and Boss and her first medal of the season guaranteed. But would it be enough for gold? Last week's winner, Janine Flock, the World Cup points leader, had broken her own We Gold track record in heat one and she was ahead of Nikitina all the way down. But ahead wasn't enough. She broke the track record again to take a six and a half tenths of a second win, more than doubling her first heat advantage over the Russian. A stunning start to the season for Janine Flock, two gold medals. Elena Nikitina took silver today ahead of Kimberly Boss and Tina Herman tied for the bronze. And it's Janine Flock who's our runaway World Cup leader.